Hey guys, this is Amber from Net Behavior. I'm a mom with 10 kids and we live in New York City and today we are going to church and I'm hoping we can go to a fry place or something after church because it's called, um, I don't know if we'll be able to, I don't know how far it is from church, but it's called Pommes Frites and it's like this little Belgian um, fry place which is of course exciting because you don't have to go all the way to Belgium to get Belgian fries. <laughs> we're headed to the subway and then we're going to go to our church which is is still meeting in West Village. Come with us. We have Chloe and Anna and Enoch and Moses and Daddy and the big kids already left because, well, we're slow. Um, and then Pearl and Melody, yeah, yeah. Um, they're ahead of us. And then Josiah had to stay home because he has a lesson today. His teacher at Manhattan School of Music is actually um, from Japan and so his teacher flies back and forth from Japan to Manhattan School of Music to teach so he can only have so many lessons um, obviously because you know he's at the mercy of when he's you know in America but when there's an opening he has to take it so an adventure I did tell Josiah if we do make it to the the fry place that I will bring him home a treat so <laughs> Hopefully he does good in his lesson. He'll have a fry reward when he comes home. <laughs> Excited? Mm -hmm. Yeah. That place is so young. Yeah, they've been there before. We had some friends from the Bay Area that came and they uh, said it was supposed to be really good. So, so I need to take someone from out of town to come in and tell you where you should be going. <laughs> so we're in Harlem and we're going to go south to... West Village, so that's going to be about a oh, 20 minute subway ride. Here's the fruit stand on the way to the 123 station, and then here's this little prime bike. Oh, 23, that's right, she's correcting me. One, we have to go all I think to Columbus Circle, right, to get to that, or somewhere else. No, you you can go to 96th Street, but on the you can take A or D to Columbus Circle. And Okay, so she's, these kids can be tour guides, <laughs> they know where everything is. have a broken sign here so <laughs> watch out church it's about 54 degrees today just like seeing doggies but he won't touch one yeah like Moses Moses loves all the doggies sometimes when he's sitting on the stairs when, at 125th he'll see doggies and the people stop <laughs> but, but he, he won't, won't touch him yeah he's nervous Pearl has her viola because she's going to go practice after our little shindig. Done with church, and we're going to make the journey to the fry place. It's actually a 12 minute walk. You guys ready for a 12 minute walk? <laughs> we're very it's Mo. Are you ready to walk 12 minutes? Daddy will probably have to carry you. <laughs> Can I tip you? So we are on the journey. Amy's wearing her cute. Show me your cute birthday sweater. You make it look good. <laughs> leader. If it was me leading, we'd get lost. So, <laughs> thankfully, she knows where she's kind of going. She's got her phone. I'm navigating. Elijah has a skateboard, so he's faster than us. We're in a bit of a rush, but there's this super cute bookstore across the street called 
Three Lives and Co. <laughs> I totally want to go to it at some point. And here's our ice cream place. They always have the coolest stuff. Let's see what the flavor is. Traditional refreshing Indian drink, Tandai. That looks really good. Okay, next time. <laughs> we have to get ice cream before it gets too cold again. But today we are on a french fry mission. Oh, there's like a little cafe there with these cute little yellow chairs. It's called Jeffrey's Grocery, but it's also a restaurant and bar, so I guess it's not your normal grocery store. Here's our little... Are they open? Yeah? Okay. Okay. This is our little complete authentic Belgian fries. You don't like truffle? She had truffle before. Truffle is too strong. Well, some of the kids might like truffle. We'll see. Okay, so we're going to go in and order some fries for these people. This is a great pending, so we'll see. Hopefully. Hopefully it's okay. Very cute, very uh, cool. Reminds me of this little town of NC, which is kind of next to this result. So you can put your fries in this little thing here. That's so cute. Looks like it's in here. The little window over there is so cute. Oh, did Pearl have to go? Oh, okay. Well, we'll have to bring her some. She let us here. She let us here. We'll have to bring her some fries home. Yeah, she leave. Okay, so I got some weird things. Elijah, help me. We got, uh, let's see, Greek fries, poutine. I don't know what poutine is. It's, it's like a cheese gravy. with grape. It's, it's like fries with cheese and gravy. Fries with cheese and gravy. I think it's a Bel Belgian, like, Belgian, Canadian. Belgian so. Canadian? Okay. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. So I'm sure someone it's will correct me. I got one regular truffle fries. I know you guys don't like it, but me and Daddy are me and Daddy and Joe probably. And then I got two regular fries. And then we got blue cheese sauce, roasted garlic sauce, aioli. Let's should this garlic, right? Aioli. Aioli. Garlic aioli. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know my stuff. We've watched Master. Rosemary garlic, tequila lime, chipotle war sauce, which is Indonesian peanut saute sauce, and wild mushroom sauce. Elijah takes ketchup and uh, fries and ketchup very seriously. <laughs> Pearl had to go for her um, little ketchup practice, I guess. Mo likes ketchup. It's almost like we didn't need to get fries. We could just eat, sit here and eat ketchup. <laughs> now, the way it's supposed to be done is mayonnaise. Mayonnaise, yes. That's how the true Belgians would do it. But I bet the sauces have some mayonnaise in them. Liz is just chowing down on ketchup. That's a good way to live life. <laughs> the menu is actually has a lot of interesting things like pomegranate teriyaki, they even have something called warm Irish curry, truffle supreme. Thank you. It's all my bags. Thank you. Thank you. Fries. Pomfrit. We actually got it to go, but we might eat some here. And then we'll, we'll take the rest to go. Here's the poutine rice. Oh no, you guys are right now. Sorry, here, bring Here's our sauces bag. Okay, who wants who wants war sauce? I think this is actually like a Indonesian sauce, maybe? Is that what it is? I don't know which one this is. This might be Greek. Greek fries, I'm not sure. This is wild mushroom, probably not Chloe's favorite. Let's see here. This is blue cheese. You want some blue cheese? There goes my top. Wow. <laughs> it's hot, huh? Uh, rosemary garlic. That looks good. And we've got, uh, let's see here, roasted garlic. It's probably also very good. Oh, daddy has wipes. 
TLC. I don't know what that means. Oh, tequila lime chipotle? Is that what it is? Tequila lime chipotle? As if fries couldn't get any better, guys. Oh, and then they gave us some ketchup, too. I think the rest might just be ketchup. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Open up. Come on, try it. No, it's really yummy. No. No. Okay. He <laughs> just likes the ketchup. <laughs> There's the poutine fries. Uh, I guess. Tequila lime chipotle? Because it's good. I thought alcohol was gross. Probably not alcoholic. These, these are the regular fries. Oh no, she's having regular fries. Well, there's some regular fries. Okay, yes. There's two things that regular. That makes it a little more calmer for the little ones. See, it's good, huh, Mo? It's a little hot. It's a little hot. Yeah. <laughs> trying the tequila lime chipotle sauce. <laughs> Yumi says it's really good. Hmm, it is surprisingly good, actually. <laughs> what is the, has anyone tried the war sauce? Wow, it's really spicy. It's pretty spicy. Oh, that's a war that? sauce. It's like, um, do you like it? I don't know what it is. So the war sauce is Indonesian pita, um, Indonesian peanut sauce. Not for me. Not for you? <laughs> Not for me. So, I'm try it. Do you try the wild mushroom? What kind is this, garlic? This is wild mushroom that's, um, Rosemary. Oh, rosemary. Okay. So, Chloe will not like the wild mushroom, Mommy, but she might like the this. rosemary. Yeah? Oh, that's cool. No, I'm just trying the Greek fries. Are those Greek? Yeah. yeah. There's some sort of mm. cheese or something on there. Here's the rosemary garlic. Give it a go. That's rosemary. Oh, no, I wonder why they have yet. It's really good. Reminds me of, um, I used to, I used to work in bakery. And we used to have. I did. I went to bakery. No, we're not about this. This oh, okay. is so good. And they had rosemary garlic bread. It reminds me of that. This one? War sauce? Yeah. This is so good. What kind is that? Blue cheese? Blue cheese. Blue cheese and I try a little Nobody opened it yet because they all hate blue cheese. Which one is this? Never. Mmm, it is good. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I mean. Okay, mom is gonna try the war sauce. I don't like it. It's just like peanut butter on a fry. It is pretty weird. It's definitely like. It has like a peanut sauce taste to it. Very creative. We only should have only gotten one of the show. Oh, yeah, I want to try the cookies. What's in there anyway? Mmm. Gravy, cheese curd. It's good, but man. Okay. Put like. So, Mama tried the um, poutine. It's Canadian curd, cheddar cheese, and vegetarian gravy. So it's very, um, it's very rich. <laughs> like we definitely bought more food than we need. Yeah. Uh. It's good though. Okay. I just got the poutine going on over here. <laughs> I tried some. It's pretty good. Papa. <laughs> Yeah, water is in high demand around right here. It's salty. Usually we have a like sweet treat, but it's just a salty treat. So my conclusion is this is not diet. <laughs> it is a fun thing once in a while. Yeah, not. <laughs> it's not a way to stay slim. That's for sure. <laughs> this is the wild mushroom sauce. So gotta go. That's good. I like the I like the mushroom sauce best. I think like, so far. No, no, what? Not that. This is roasted garlic. This is mushroom. This is rosemary garlic. This is tequila. And that's blue cheese. Blue cheese. Mm. Okay. The con fry connoisseurs around here. Um, no, that's mushroom. Yeah. This is good. What? They're, they're not trouble fries. They're meat fries. Yeah. Yeah. No, we got one truffle fry. Just a little yeah. bit. So we're trying Mama. the Greek fries. They like these better than the truffle fries. Mama. Just had a truffle fries. Yes, baby. Mama. You want some water? Yeah. Here's the Greek fries. Got some sort of Greek cheese on it. 
Or you can just can you have some of your water? Yeah, you can have my water. It's awesome. Yeah. He's gonna There's get the, floaters in it. He's like beet fries. I think it has dill in it. It's almost like tzatziki meat fry. <laughs> <laughs> He's in a fry coma. <laughs> Spider-Man <No. laughs> Oh, that's the news over there. Stand to. Okay, so we managed to uh, fill up the kids, and we still have a lot of food left, so we have some to bring home for Pearl and Josiah. <laughs> Everyone's full. <laughs> yeah, this gentleman over here said French fries make the world go round. I think that's true. <laughs> 76 years. <laughs> He's still living large. <laughs> Have a good day. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Aw, thank you. He liked our little video we were making. So we made it through. The kids are full. We were going to go home and make shish kebabs right away. But we'll, we usually do busking on Sunday, so we'll probably go busking first and then have our, <laughs> have our shish kebabs because everyone is so full. Um, so across the way is Mamu, Mamu, I don't know how to say that, Mamu's Falafel and Players Theater and Olive Tree Cafe and Bar. And all of these places actually look really, ooh, Ethiopian cuisine. You see that down there, Mark? That would be cool. I wonder if it's actually open. And they have Hong Kong street food down there. May Lai Wa. That sounds good. Okay, so we have lots of places to try. So here's the outside of the place. Yeah, of course they sell beer too. We didn't get any beer. <laughs> but I love the like little like 3D fries. That's so cute. Uh-oh, somebody's somebody's bike just went, went over like that. It's the wind. It's really windy. No, the wind blew it over. So Mark, tell me your story about your pommes frites in, uh, was it Belgium? Oh, yeah, yeah, so we we went, uh, my aunt and uncle took us, took their family and we uh, visited some, some uh, I, I forgot what town in Belgium, but after a long day of walking around and seeing a bunch of things, we were hungry and we stopped in the, in the town square. They had a bunch of uh, vendors who were selling fries. Were they in the little cones like that? Yeah, in little paper cones. I bet they didn't have tequila lime sauce or whatever. No, it was mayo. <laughs> mayo, all no, mayo, no yes. No ketchup, I mean, no ketchup. just straight mayo. Just mayo. <laughs> uh, let's see. There's, there's, there's quite a few stations around here. There's a number of them. This is Ben's Pizza. It says it's the most Mommy, famous pizza the in the world. In the house over I don't there. know if it is or not. Look at the leaves. Oh, that's so interesting. Yeah, there's leaves on the house over there. They're blowing so much. They it were, is such it was, a windy it day. Cool before. Yeah, it it's looked, so it beautiful. Wow. There's a tea place. So they have matcha tea, Thai iced tea, pinky milky, and Thai iced coffee. That looks so good. There's an express halal food cart over there. That looks pretty good. There's definitely no lack of food to eat around here. Of course, it's a little bit expensive, but you know, if you don't have a, if you don't have a giant family, <laughs> everything's cheaper. Everything we do is a little more expensive. That's why we only go out once a week usually, if that. Probably an A train, or there's a oh there's B, B D F M. So we're waiting for an A, right? Yeah, I never know what train. <laughs> well, I just scooped it out, and he said the D is not coming for a while, so we're waiting for the A. I want a backpack for my birthday. You want a backpack for your birthday? Yeah, well, we should try okay. find her a smaller backpack. Probably a smaller one. Yeah. I we can like the one Moses has. Yes. But Here's our A train. Get in there before the doors close. Is he hopeful entrance?
Do you love the train? Because I'm not caught anymore. <laughs> yeah, it's nice. the street is the Presbyterian Church of Ghana in New York and they always come out wearing the coolest looking outfits. We are back in Harlem. Okay, a little crew. <laughs> We're home. Mo fell asleep again on daddy's shoulder. Oh, there's a beautiful face. Daddy's a good daddy. Who brought you gummies from Juilliard? Chloe. Chloe. Chloe I brought asked you. for them. I Are they from the vending machine? She asked me for worm gummies, but then she told Melody that they were disgusting. Are they? Yeah. Are they from the vending machine? Oh, can huh? I tell you something? Mm -hmm. Chloe said that um she just had to waste a three um a whole three dollars because she was gonna I, she was gonna get something from the vending machine, but then it didn't work. They just stole. They oh, just stole their money. That's a good way to make money if you're a vending machine, I guess. <laughs> anyway, so the excitement is um, the vending machine at Juilliard because it has all these exciting things, and the little kids at home order things from the vending machine at Juilliard. <laughs> yeah, we we can have a clipboard. So, um, yeah, so we're full from fries, so we'll probably do a busking first and then our shish kebabs, so. Oh, Rex probably gonna take the girls out. Big kids are probably gonna go out. That's how we, that's how we pay for our music. <laughs> Here's what's going on with our shish kebabs. We actually just marinated this in some soyaki sauce from Trader Joe's. And then um, Mark earlier, he chopped up some of the veggies and we're just gonna put some canned pineapple too on there. and white rice and the kids this is a, one of the kids favorite meals actually it's easy but fun and Josiah is currently having his lesson so we'll, we'll come back probably have some pommes frites as well <laughs> sure will be happy to see that Josiah came home from his lesson Mommy, can I yes. poutine no I mean, more it. sorry for everything than usual <laughs> sorry 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 eh? so Josiah's Came home with a hearty appetite. That's good because we have lots of extra fries. Oh, good. Okay. I can help with that. <laughs> so Josiah is fat and happy now. So he was telling me about Ben Franklin. What, was, what did Ben Franklin uh, do? Uh, Thomas Jefferson. So oh, Thomas Jefferson. When he went sorry. to France, he uh, brought, you know, one of his enslaved people and he soaked up a lot of the French ways of, uh, you know, making food. And uh, one of the things was um, like a very thinly sliced sliced potato so just like french fries except even thinner i think so okay. yeah it's not quite french fries that that's sort of a myth that like thomas jefferson and his enslaved people introduced fries fries to america but it's pretty close <laughs> that's cool okay so that's that's you heard it first here i guess well probably somewhere else but <laughs> yeah <laughs> shish kebabs so <laughs> they had all the rest of the extra fries and they're making the shish kebabs and that's gonna be dinner got the little kids over here they're playing with play-doh watching miss rachel 
This is the beautiful stack of hearts that Melody made me. That is beautiful. It's out of Play-Doh cake <laughs> and cookie. What's well, a cookie? It's a cookie cake? Yeah. She made me a bowl. That's nice, Melody. It's a heart bowl. Daddy's out here making us some shish kebabs. Shish kebabies. Wow, it is windy out here. The trees are really going for it. So it'll be shish kebabs or then cooking some of them. I think Mark's finishing up some more out there. We got our rice in the instant pot. Happy times. Pearl still has midterms, right? Are these your last midterms is coming up this week? Yeah. So she's diligent. <laughs> we got Play-Doh all over the table. It's good for development, but it sure is messy, isn't it, Mo? Duck, Play-Doh. <laughs> Do you play with Play-Doh? Is it stuck in there? Yeah. It's stuck. Okay, we'll have to get it out. Thanks for joining us for our Sunday adventure.